I wanted to be able to run any GUI, Linux GUI, and I can do it graphically now and have access to the graphics drivers and stuff. But I, I want to be able to use WSLG. So WSL graphics, they've added this to the WSLG. It's great. Um, and the first thing I would do before doing anything fancy is just do a WSL update. That'll get you the latest version of WSL, the latest version of WSLG, and a whole bunch of other stuff. And you can actually see that if I were to do WSL. You can see that here, right? I, I, the, when I was on the one before this, which was only, I don't know how old, um, you only got one like one version number back. Now I get a whole bunch of stuff back because I'm on a later version and you can see I'm running WSLG and that's the latest. So, and then in my case, I, you can do this with Ubuntu, you can do it with any Linux. I, the, the easiest Linux to do this with right now is Kelly because they created a package for it. You don't have any work to do, it's amazing. So really you only need to do the update, the upgrade and install Kelly when Kex. In my case, I installed everything. This made the thing a lot bigger because um, I was thinking of really using it for stuff. It installs Java, installs Python. Well, that was already there. There's just a bunch of pieces. Chrome, um, Visual Studio Code, open source. I didn't even know there was a version. Now I gotta go look and see what that means. Anyway, you do that one time, you do this update. Um, and then all you got to do from inside a terminal prompt in that server, I tried to get this WSL one to work from uh, the this one here. But anyway, so just go to a prompt. And so we'll just go in here. And I'm sitting on the power, my does I have a power spec? Um, I'm sitting on the power spec and, you know, run. Sitting on, I'm sitting on my, uh, Kali Linux, and then all I do is I type in, you know what, let's just do it really dumb. I'm just gonna type kex. The first time you do this, it'll ask you to set up a password for this so people can't get in. And that's it. And now I have, uh, I'm sitting on that, and I did a bunch of installs, so I have all, all these different applications, and basically this is Kali, so it's got a bunch of penetration. So I did it because um, most, anyway, I did it because this was super easy and it was an, a one-liner and to get out of it, I'm just going to log out. And that brings me back. And it's cool. That's all you need to do. Just install this one package and run this command and you're done.